Hi guys, welcome and or welcome back. I am Raven and this is my bathroom. So I haven't really seen a lot of reviews on this particular Simply Hair. Like I've seen the Simply 7, Simply 8, Simply 9, I think it was, but I'm not finding a whole bunch of just plain Simply Brazilian unprocessed. Um, the lady in the beauty spa store said that it was leaving and not coming back and I'm not sure if it's not selling too well or if there's too many bad reviews or what's going on with it but I mean honestly so far I like it I don't have any complaints there's no nasty smell mm, it actually smells really good <laughs> this is the Otre uh, simply non-processed Brazilian body wave made in china i got it in 30 inches natural black um yeah so i was in the beauty supply store and i was looking for some 24 to 26 inch hair and i saw this if this is made in china if this came from china if this is chinese hair quote unquote i mean because they claim it's brazilian body but if this is chinese hair then it probably is processed because uh, as far as I know Chinese people don't have straight hair I mean they don't have uh, wavy hair um, but so far I've been pulling at the bundles um, since I got home and even honestly in the car as I'm driving and I do get at least a string um, maybe eight out of ten times not really honestly I don't even think it's that much but I do notice when I'm putting when I'm running my fingers through this hair I hear a crunch which sounds like breaking hair um so I'm gonna stop doing that and then that's the only time I get shedding because other than that as long as I don't run my fingers through the hair and just pull at the hair in the hole I get no shedding so um, there have been reviews uh, or a video or a few videos about this hair tangling and smelling really bad once you wash it. I kind of want to try to wash it and see what happens. But Outre or Outre, whatever you call it, it's a, uh, I mean, it's honestly overall, it's a great company. So for them to give off poopy hair. I don't know, but we'll see. Um, I'm going to, I want to, honestly, I want to wash one of these bundles just to see what happens with it. But I'm scared to do that because um, I don't want to ruin it. Uh, but yeah, I don't know. We're going to see how this thing rolls. Oh, the ends. The ends feel a little something. I don't know what it is. It's not nappy. It's not tangly. It's not really crunchy per se. I don't know what it is. So it could be my paranoia because I didn't feel it until I started watching the videos. So we'll see what happens. But anyway, so uh, this hair, honestly, it doesn't stink. It smells like hair. It smells like the hair that you get out of the beauty supply store, which like I've said in previous videos, my hair doesn't stay smelling that way because I spray perfume in my hair. But yeah, and so I've been trying to figure out if I want to actually dye this hair purple or leave it the way it is. I'm not sure yet. I don't know what I'm going to do. I might bleach it to be a lighter brown or maybe give me some highlights. But if the hair is already like processed and all kinds of things and I'm kind of scared to do that too so we'll just wait and see what happens but yeah um anyway so that is my input on this hair before I actually install it so we will see what the rest is looking like. all right you guys so a thing that is talked about is about how the hair changes color when you put it in uh, water or shampoo or whatever okay so You can see that the hair is indeed 
processed. And I also smell the processed smell like I've gotten a relaxer. Is all of the hair that actually came out uh, during the wash and condition. So that's actually not a lot for 30 inch hair. Um, this is all hair that's been in the brush before. <laughs> I didn't clean the brush out, so forgive me for that, but you get over it. Um, but yeah, so this is the hair almost completely dry. Um, it turned into like a body wave and I thought I, I wanted a, a deep wave, but this is okay. And then this one looks like it's going to turn out a little bit, a whole lot more straighter than the other, than the others. Um, so during the blow drying process, <clears throat> I haven't had any bad experiences with, um, any bad experiences. Don't look up there. Okay. During the conditioning and blow drying process, I haven't had any, um, shedding or tangling or anything like that. So, so far so good. Um, the hair smells great. Um, but I'm pretty sure that's because of the products that I use in it. Hi guys. Okay, so this is the hair installed. So this is my first day wearing it. Um, I didn't have any issues so far. Um, here's the hair. So as you can see, it's really, really flowy. It's very, very soft. Um, I'm having more issues with my hair than I am with the weave and I have taken it out into the humidity. It holds a curl pretty well as you can see right there. Um, but yeah, so I am pretty much wearing my hair in the middle part. Um, I'm like super sleepy. Um, But I'm not, I'm not really having much trouble with it. It's fairly decent hair so far. Um, not much shedding, not much tangling. Well, no tangling, honestly, uh, other than your normal tangling, I guess. Um, I mean, with it being 30 inch hair, which I didn't measure, and the way I have been behaving with this hair and I mean, it's on my Snapchat. I'm like swinging the hair around constantly, hitting people in the face just because I can, you know. <laughs> um, but it, it's doing really, really well. This at the top right here is some other hair, I believe made by Outre, but yeah, it is actually Outre hair. Um, and I didn't do a review on that, but it is, again, bundle hair. Um, but this here at the bottom, it is the outre. It is sewn in. The top is glued because I got lazy and the 30 inch hair is fairly heavy and I did not want to attempt to glue the hair in. And I want to see honestly how long I can wear this hair before I start getting problems like other people are talking about. Just real quick, I wanted to come and tell you guys that this hair is starting to shed it's starting to shed it's starting to shed it's starting to shed um i can tolerate it i can tolerate shedding so it's fine by me but it is starting to come out like in clumps kind of like the wig that i had uh what was it was it the orbit i think it was the orbit wig um that was starting to shed a lot um but yeah but overall, I mean, so far, the hair's still good so far. So we'll keep waiting to see what happens. But I just wanted to give you guys an update on this hair. Um, like over time passes, I'm still not getting much tangling. I don't want to jinx it. Um, so, I mean, it does the normal tangling that normal ta hair does when you move around a lot, which I do. Um, in the know for the past like few days I haven't been sleeping in my satin bonnet nor have I I don't like the hair so long it's not all gonna fit on my satin pillowcase or my satin pillow so of course no it's not being put on the satin pillow while I'm sleeping um, so that's that for now
and I will check in with you guys later. There's video footage of me washing the hair. It's processed, it's dyed, it's chemically imbalanced, we shall say. Okay, so after I wore the hair for about maybe, I want to say, <clears throat> a few days, I noticed that the hair was a bit tangly and you could not run your fingers directly through the hair, although it was not tangled. Okay, this is the hair today. Okay, this is it. Um, yeah, uh, this is the hair washed and conditioned and blow, was it hair dried or blow dried? I'm not sure, but, and it sheds, terribly. So you'll get about that much hair. Uh, every time you run your hands through the hair. This reminds me of the wig that I had from Outre or Outre, however you pronounce it. Um, the one where I put that I love the wig and then later on I put on, I had a video saying I think I ruined my hair with Daily Defenders. Okay, so let's talk about Daily Defenders. Daily Defenders did not ruin my hair. This hair ruined my hair, okay? Look at this. Um, so as much as I love Outre, 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 I will not be purchasing this hair ever again. It needs to go away. Uh, this was a waste of $206. Uh, that was after the taxes. Uh, I will never buy Outre's non-processed hair ever again because I'm noticing a common pattern. All the hair, including the wigs, just like this. Yeah, we, 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 don't, we don't need little octopuses in our heads. Um, it doesn't look that tangly per se, uh, but uh, it is. Uh, honestly, I went to a reptile expo and I was so embarrassed I braided the hair. I braided this hair into a big braid and it was very cute for all of 15 minutes. And then slowly the hair started matting together and matting together and eventually it looked like one giant dreadlock. Um, and that was after, again, 15 minutes. So this hair, trash. Won't ever be purchasing this hair again. Yeah, this right here, Big old fat no-no, okay? Yeah. So, I just wanted to do the ending part of the video so that I could throw this hair away and move on. And yes, I have lots and lots and lots of content. Guys, I have stopped struggling for content. <laughs> Ain't that amazing? Okay, yeah, so anyway, um, if you like this video, hit the like button. If you don't like it, hit the dislike button. If you want to subscribe, welcome. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.